Hi there, you're watching Market Glance, an overview of the top stories which may affect your trades as reported by Investing.com and brought to you by Dugascopy TV. The dollar gained ground against the euro and the yen on Friday as upbeat US economic reports eased concerns over outlook for recovery after a week of volatile trading. Dollar yen was up by 0.53% to 108.88 late Friday. The dollar fell against the other major currencies on Wednesday, touching a one month low against the yen. Friday also saw the euro dollar slide 0.38% to 127.59. This was after Thursday when European Central Bank official Ewald Notoni said the bank still had leeway for more action to address slowing inflation in the euro area and added that quantitative easing would start as soon as December. Copper futures edged lower during the European morning trade on Monday as market players looked ahead to key economic data, which could provide more evidence of a slowdown in China. On the COMEX division of the New York Mercantile Exchange, copper for December delivery traded at $2.98 a pound during European morning hours, down 1.5 cents or 0.51%. Chinese economic data due on Tuesday will have further indications on the strength of the economy and the future path of monetary policy. Recent economic data from the Asian nation has indicated that the recovery remains fragile and may require further monetary stimulus. China's central bank signaled plans on Friday to inject as much as 200 billion yuan in short-term loans to the nation's banks. Gold futures ended Friday's session modestly lower as market sentiment stabilised, although prices still posted a weekly gain as concerns over the global economic outlook boosted safe haven demand. On the COMEX division of the New York Mercantile Exchange, gold for December delivery lost $2.20 or 0.18% to settle at $1,239, a troy ounce by close of trade. Despite Friday's downbeat performance, COMEX gold prices still rose by $17.30 or 1.39% on the week, the second consecutive weekly gain. Also on the COMEX, silver for December delivery shed 10.6 cents or 0.61% on Friday to settle the week at $17.33 a troy ounce. And copper for December delivery fell to a session low of $2.95 a pound. Crude oil futures ended Friday's session modestly higher as investors returned to the market to seek cheap valuations after New York traded oil futures tumbled to $79.78 a barrel on Thursday, a level not seen since June 2012. Meanwhile, London traded Brent prices fell to $82.93 on Thursday, the lowest level seen since December 2010. December delivery tacked on $0.34 cents, or 0.4% on Friday to settle at $86.16 a barrel by close of trade. A report earlier in the month showed that the organisation of the petroleum exporting country's oil output hit a two-year high of 31 million barrels per day in September, led by higher production from Iraq and Libya. That's all for Market Glance. Thanks for watching and keep tuning in to Dukascopy TV for our regular updates.